Khalid and Choma were outside last night, this time in Las Vegas, and they had the time of their lives. Thank you guys. I love you guys. Thank you for supporting me over the years. My poor fam. One, two, one, two, three, let's go. Hey! I absolutely love the relationship the video has with the brands he works with. Hey, 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 hey. I love their relationship because it is that of mutual respect. So, Puma was actually one of the sponsors of a game, Formula One game that was played in Las Vegas, and they invited David as one of their brand ambassadors to come witness it live and direct. I think I have said this severally, if I had a brand and could afford an A-list artist, I will definitely call David. So here we have the video and Jeff Hamilton the at the formula one las vegas like i said a time was had they had a great time the video was super excited and of course they had um lunch before they went for the event later that night but at the event hmm, a time was had david had a lot to say david, about me, david? that Yo. event um, oh my god they are fast like the cars were pretty fast and david was kind of intrigued oh, by how fast the cars tonight. were i got a one million dollar piece coming tell them we outside one million dollar piece what the fuck you talking about <laughs> So that's David and his crew heading to Puma store in Las Vegas. <laughs> this is such a big deal. This is one of Puma's biggest flagship stores and that's David's song playing right there. Well, Choma did it. <laughs> attend a lot of those activities with them i guess maybe she was resting or with the twins i really don't even know if she traveled with the babies Let's get this. Let's get this. So here we have the likes of Ubi, we have Dre, we have Spesh, uh, you just saw Lati, David PA, among um, some other guys who also work with David. Guys, one of the perks of working with a superstar is that you get to travel. Look at Israel. Israel now has over five visas and has access to over 200 countries. My sister, even people with doctorates still struggle though. This is such a big deal. So back to David's Las Vegas group. We have Special Special, we have Lati, we have, um, of course, we have Lati here. We have Asa, David's manager. You can see David going through the clothes racks at the Palmer store in Las Vegas. Mm -hmm. 
I have really been meaning to crop one of these Puma products. One thing David will do is to shop because tell me why this guy is still buying shoes. Maybe he's buying for his people though. Because at the end of the day, most times he gets a lot of these shoes as, um, you know, as part of the PR. Some of these, um, being a brand, a brand ambassador, of course, comes with we certain tags. But see, you can be the best the So, of course, we have them here. Of course, heading to the venue of the Formula One event. And this Formula One event is quite hilarious because... The way most of them were shaking their necks because the cars were speeding so much. I was like, is this really the definition of fun? But I guess I know some people love sports a lot. So that's just their thing. So I would like to know if there have been cases of casualties from these Formula One race. <laughs> <laughs> so let's take a look at more moments from David's visit to Poma store. I don't know who that young lady is, but the person she was hugging is David's former lawyer, Bobo Ajudwa. So guys, let's quickly wrap this up and uh, before I show you some moments from David's concerts that I didn't get to show the last time. So I'd like to know guys, have there been cases of casualties during games like this? Considering how fast the cars speed, I am thinking have they had cases where they had like accidents and they had to rescue people, lives were lost and all of that or they have never experienced that i would like to know from people who watch formula one because to be very honest that's one sport i am naturally not a sporty person but formula one like it's a no i can maybe football a bit of football a bit of long tennis but you see this formula one mm -mm. i'm blue if i was green i would die if i was green i would die if i was green i would Here, Onyekwa, who is this please? What's her name? Omo Sea Facilities, can Nigeria ever host? at all and i heard that former um eminent face of africa miss eminent face of africa or something oluchi onwaba her son Ugochuku, is one of the best formula one players in the world guys <laughs> you see that proud ninja moment <laughs> David's former lawyer, Bobo Ajudwa, is what evil people call Huichiri, a guim. The guy no one lose car though. He is still like in gum body, like chewing gum to David. He is not ready to let Brick, go. we out here. We out here. Puma. David, where did you bring me, David? Yo, from Monaco. Oh, what, what? Vegas! But wait, they don't know what we got coming tonight. I got a one million dollar piece coming, tell them. We outside. One million dollar piece. So I'd like to know, are there Nigerians, I mean those based in this country who love Formula One? Like you actually said to watch it or you will pay to watch i'd like to know in the comment section because i don't think it's such a popular spot
Yeah. Yes, sir. All right, brother. Man, this view is even crazier. My man Ed, thank you, brother. more moments from David's concert in ETL. You can tell Choma is a lover of music because she knows a lot of songs even though she doesn't socialize that much. So let's take a look at what David's management room looked like. Like the people who put together the fantastic show. How many people do you recognize here? You can see Asa, David's longtime manager. We have Ubi. I don't know what role Ubi plays in David's team though. Yeah, I don't know. So we have David's cousin Shade who flew into America a few hours <laughs> The bond between their daddy keys is <laughs> So I'd like to know if you are enjoying the vlog so far or do you think it is boring? Easy money Easy money See guys, one day I will speak about how obsessed Sofia Momodu's fans are. Like it is so annoying. Walking apart, man. Easy money. <laughs> when I don't like someone, I don't go about burning my data watching them. But Sofia's fans, any vlog with the caption Chioma David, they will come and guess what? At the end of the day, they will end up disgracing themselves in the comment section. You will just know that they sat down to watch. How do you watch something that torments you? Like, how do you do that? New one. That's yeah, a nigga. brand new one. Here we have Asa Asika distributing the tickets to crew members. In the past, this used to be Bobo's role, and then according to rumors, then Bobo will carry the invites and give to most of his wife's friends. At the end of the day, people like Israel and Co will be stranded without it. <laughs> So here we have Choma and David's cousin for Lashade digging it down on the dance floor. So before you come and start asking silly questions like, we are the twins, my dear. I am sure the twins are somewhere well taken care of. You cannot cry more than the bereaved, okay? Choma is a fantastic mom, so is Davy, the fantastic dad. So they know how to take care of their babies. So I don't want to hear, oh, where are they? Uh, how come? And they are here. Their twins are nowhere to be found. Because a lot of times, eh, Nigerians say, eh, Una, they stress me, no be small. 
I know how mentally and physically draining it is to be a twin mom. So every time I see Chioma outside excited and partying, I'm literally so happy for her because I know that, man, that is not, being a twin mom is not easy. And a lot of times we don't get to see Chioma a lot. So whenever we see her, we're like, okay, those of us that like her love that she is happy and living her life. <laughs> I actually missed Kobana Chief Priest's vibe in this <laughs> You will agree with me that it takes a village to have a smooth and successful show. Like here you can see David's cousin, Shadi Dre, and David himself. <laughs> So here we have Choma and her paddy Ubi Franklin. We have Folashadi seated beside her is Israel. David loves food so much. No, it's hot to be careful. Mm -hmm, I told you. And God gave him a chef. Choma is the perfect woman for David. This is something so. I really do miss the days Choma lived in Nigeria. Oh my god. <laughs> if I's departure changed everything. David and the F word. This one of the mode is standing like someone that is catching cold. Yes, well, from Society Hotspot, we say belated happy birthday to my favorite Afrobeat superstar. We pray that God's blessings and light continues to shine upon you, David. You put smiles on the faces of a lot of people. And may God continue to put smiles on your face and that of your wife. And may happiness never depart from you. Cheers to many happy returns.